and welcome back how are you all doing today good bad song and twin so today is going to be another hotel review video and yes this is another hotel from the road trip i did last year and that was in june so yeah it's starting to be one year ago <laughs> i'm just really late with everything sorry <laughs> okay so the hotel i'm going to be reviewing today is days in by winham in crystal river so as i always do i will show you guys how it looks like made it to Crystal River, so we're gonna go and eat at Dennis and a hotel is over there. Here is the hotel room in Crystal River. Pleasantly surprised. Yeah. Did not expect it. I had no expectations. <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> so, two beds, TV, fridge, microwave, and toilet. Shower, sink, an iron clothes, coffee maker. Yeah. <laughs> hey. It's simple but good. It smells like uh bleach. Bleach, yeah. <laughs> A lot, but it's just been clean. So. Yeah, so it's clean. It's a bit clean at least. <laughs> Alright, so we only stayed there for one night. We, all, we paid $67 to stay there. I checked other prices for now and then also the next year and it's about the same price. It goes between the price of 60, uh, $67 and $83, depending a little bit on when you're staying there and how far in advance you're booking. But you also have to take into consideration the time that we are living in right now. So hotel prices might change, change a lot. It might be cheaper, it might become more expensive, depending a little bit um, how it's going to evolve. So yeah, uh, just keep that in mind when you're booking hotels right now that a lot can change within days or minutes. So we didn't really have any expectation when we were booking this hotel because, because of the fact that other hotels we looked at um, in the same area where it didn't look the best. Uh, so we didn't really have an expectation whatsoever, we've never been to Crystal River before, so we didn't know what to expect. So when we got there, we were pleasantly surprised because of the fact that the hotel room were big, they were clean. And as you, as you can hear me saying in the video, we can, we can literally smell that it's just been cleaned, which is good. Don't get me wrong, uh, it wouldn't hurt the hotel to do a little bit of renovating, for example, remove the wall to wall carpet and have a regular floor instead and stuff like that. But compared to the other hotels that we looked at in the same area, this was definitely one of the best hotels <laughs> in Chrysler. I would say personally, like I said, I haven't stayed at the other hotels, but from what I could see from pictures, um, this seemed like one of the more like better hotel in Chrysler River area. It was only like four or five hotels in the area because Chrysler River is quite a small place. I don't think a lot of tourists stay like for a night in Crystal River, and that's probably the reason why uh, there's not a lot of hotels in this, in this area. But we decided to stay at the hotel because of the fact that our uh, the swimming with mantis was such uh, was so early in the morning. By the way, big shout out to Sandra for <laughs> helping me out and figure out like time, like prices and um, stuff like that. Because she has all of the screenshots because she booked most of the hotels. So if it hadn't been for her, I would never be been able to do all of my hotel reviews because I'm really late with it. I really should start doing hotel reviews when I'm actually there. <laughs> Instead of waiting until I get back home, let me know if that's something you wouldn't like me to do, like actually just doing the review when I'm there. <laughs> and this hotel that we stayed at was also really close to the company we were using to swim with manatees slash float with manatees, not sure what's the correct way to say it. Um, it was like a one minute walk from the hotel, which was awesome. So we didn't really have to like wake up super early and we can also uh, keep our stuff at the hotel instead of like driving. That was one of the things we were looking at when booking a hotel in Crystal River. And because the reason we stay, stayed in Crystal River was because we were doing the uh, manatees activities. So it was high on our priority list to be close to where we were going. And it was just like a one minute walk, like it was straight beside there. So that's good. <laughs> As you can see, the hotel has a fridge with all this like, it had a microwave even, and also coffee and tea. 
I didn't see the laundry area, but according to their own webpage, they do have it, so I trust that. I also saw a picture on online of it, so that probably is a laundry area, but I didn't look for it. There was also like an ice cube machine there. There was also a pool, but it's already raining when they want to use it, so... <laughs> but there is a pool there, which I think is nice. And there's also free parking, uh, which is good because this is an area you need to drive. And also free Wi-Fi, and this pet's allowed. There wasn't any breakfast, like free breakfast, either. it was no complimentary breakfast there, but there's a dentist right beside there, so it's not, not difficult to find a place to eat breakfast. There's also a small little gift shop there, um, where you can buy small souvenirs, which is nice. So yeah, definitely it was a decent hotel for that price, and also super close to the manatee activity we were doing, so a plus for us. And one of the big things that tourists do in Crystal River is swim with manatees. So it's always nice to stay close to the area where you're going. Alright, I think that's about it. I will do a small recap. And as it's free Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi was okay. It wasn't the best, but it did work. Uh, it's free parking, which is always nice when you're traveling by car. They had coffee and tea, fridge and a microwave. No breakfast, but then it's right beside there. And definitely a clean room and a big room. Alright, so I just want to quickly jump on here because I was just speaking with Sandra on Discord and she told me something that I totally forgot to mention and that was the fact that we actually got a really early check-in without having to pay extra and also since we did the uh, swimming with manatees um, with that like company they gave us like a late checkout so we didn't have to like stress um, we're checking out before our swimming with manatee thing so I think that's a, like a general thing that you get like a late checkout if you're doing this thing with mantis, which I think is awesome because then you don't have to stress with anything. You can uh, get back to the hotel and take a shower uh, before you leave. So I just wanted to quickly mention that because I totally forgot. <laughs> All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Have you ever stayed in Crystal River before? Let me know in the comment section below and what hotel did you choose? Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys hopefully soon. Bye!